Hello and welcome to the Brick Creeks. Today we are building something from the company Mold King from their Nova Town, their modular building series, model number 16002, 2168 pieces, and it's the guitar shop or the car wash or the music store. It's, it doesn't matter. This is from a very talented man. He has a lot of Lego ideas, modulars, very creative, very cool. Uh, I try to make a link in the description if he has a replicable account, because I believe this is stolen. And if he has a replicable account, we can achieve the original instructions from there. If not, I show you the Lego ideas page from him. So at the moment, I don't know. I will show. Uh, I will have a look. We have four building steps in front of us. We have. LED lightning, this is the battery box, then we got some wires and where are the actual bricks? Here are the, the blades. This is the base blade that comes with the set. I normally don't use them here, I will use my standard base blade in grey. So, okay. So, just check out the video description where you can buy the set and, like I said, a link to replicable or ideas and uh, this set looks so awesome and I hope we have fun assembling it. Well, the first thing we assemble is a small car here. Yes, it's a car wash, so we obviously need a car. Okay, if a Cabrio perhaps is not the best car for a car wash, but okay. It's a hundred pieces, nice little build. Don't hurt anybody. Not necessary, but it don't hurts. But I have to admit, I don't know. For me, this looks a little bit cartoony. And it looks like the car from uh, Roger Rabbit. Who framed Roger Rabbit? I don't know if I'm right. It's th nearly 30 years since I watched Roger Rabbit. But I believe the car looked... A little bit like this. Write me in the comments if I'm right. Now after the car we have a lot of tiling to do, laying the tiles and so we knew the size of the modular of our house. This is our first lightened street lamp. The cable goes underneath this blade here in between the studs and what is nice that Mole King this time shows us how to manage the cables. So it's really easy. Just follow the instructions under which, which tile you have to lay the cable. Great. The lamp, the lantern. In the instructions you see you have to go from the bottom with the LED knob to the top. That's not possible because the LED knob is too, too thick for, uh, for the inlay here. So go with the connector from above and then you see that the small LED sits in there. <coughs> Sorry. I'm getting sick in my vacation. I hate it. Okay. So the first interior is coming. And here I believe this will be for all the vinyl for the LPs. This is a little bit strange. You have here modify tiles to bring something on and you just bring these pipes and they are connected with this rubber uh, connector from Technic. So why are there studs when you cover them? I don't know. Okay, this is a, a sticker here. The star on the envelope and we've got some plants and uh, a hydrant here, fire hydrant. Some more interior here, some more shelves for the car, uh, for the LPs. We have here a LP and our register, a LP, the wall, and this is really nicely made. That's the look here. The, the transparent pieces are okay, they are not milky. That they look milky here is because the other side is white, so that's, that's why it looks a little bit milky but a wall this is a nice wall i never seen such a technique 
and uh, I'm always happy if I see new things. So building step one is done and brought us here more arches and the small ones here and the bigger ones there so that's a cool and nice building technique I haven't seen before in a, in a house in a modular so here are arches too to give us a, the, a round corner here nicely made really nicely made a saxophone is here what I don't like is that the LPs here if you move the building they are falling out left and right but I believe here are studs that we build something that will cover here the LPs from falling out over and over again but so far this is really unique building uh, with a unique style and makes a lot of fun to build I'm curious about the next building step uh, the beginning of building step 2 are these transparent panels here four of them they are clicked in nice building technique so that really and barely no scratches they are all separately bagged no scratches at all that looks just awesome that's an awesome building and this this oval here look really great and we integrated our staircase and what I meant that here we're building something to cover all the LPs that they don't fall out on the side always so great this is <laughs> really amazing it's not much but it looks cool man building step 2 was really a short one yes it brought us here the unique really cool unique look of our building it brought us a palm some plants here to secure the middle of the shop with a guitar and another sticker with an LP so half of the building is done and I've never used so less, so less parts for a first floor that's really okay it's mostly all windows so that's cool I love it I love it so next building step 3 begins with the base plate for the next floor and this is really sturdy but in pink pretty in pink okay it fits perfectly here underneath here I uh, connected three more light bricks this here sits and it was easy to build it's nice but we have a lot of tiles ah, I prefer not one color but what can I do okay I can change it now the space of the second floor here you can try or hear the LPs before you buying them perhaps these are the old Technics 1210 I don't know a lot of transparent pieces another color with tar and the arches again nice we have a lot of space here but we all knew this is the guitar shop or the music shop there will be a great or a big guitar in front of here on these Technic pins so I'm excited now the room is nearly finished a lot of one by one by one transparent bricks for all the glass windows here the uh, glass brick windows <laughs> that's a lot of work and the arches an oval and here around round oval round half round that looks cool it looks cool I'm even get used to the pink that's not a good sign that's not a good sign I have to hear stones back in black so oh, building step 3 is done and brought us the nice car wash sign and here another turntable and the music store sign inside here that's all and here we have a spiral staircase uh, I'm a fan of that because they are really saving space but they are mostly not nice to build okay last bag oh, here's a little DJ booth or something the radio man yeah, with a nice ventilator here again 
the glass wall, nicely tiled, small cabin, but for just making music it's enough. Uh, it has to be something like this here. Okay, only the guitar is missing. I finished the guitar, our Fender Stratocaster, I don't know, we will see. It's a nice building technique and it's very recognizable. So, job done. Okay, we only have six things here to get stri straighten, straighten, straighten the strings. You know what I mean. Normally it must be six, but who counts? And so, after three or four hours of building fun, we have the guitar car wash, the, the music store car wash. Here it is. Battery box. The battery box should be placed in the DJ booth. And we will see how this will work out and how it looks when it's lighted. But how the whole thing will look, just watch the review. It comes in the next days. Stay tuned for the review so you see how this amazing building looks together. I'm really excited. I love this building. It's not much. It's really not much. 2000 pieces, but it looks awesome. But it looks awesome. And uh, we have a lot of spare pieces. And what I'm really curious is why are there these two or, or, or this here? I was really looking for the whole set where to find these pieces, but they are not in the set. I have them, but they are not included. So, <laughs> Mole King, you drive me crazy. You drive me crazy. Ooh. Okay, thank you for watching and stay tuned for the review. I'm Frank, have a good time.